Welcome back. The next question that we are going to revise falls under constant total, which means that the total remains the same. In this question, the ratio of Elaine's marbles to Marcus' marbles is a 5 to 11. When Marcus gave 69 marbles to Elaine, both of them end up with the same number of marbles. How many marbles do they have all together? Alright, so first of all, how do we know this question falls under constant total? It's because of this keyword here. Alright, when Marcus gave the marbles to Elaine, the total remains unchanged. Do you know why? Right, because it's an internal transfer. When Marcus gave Elaine the marbles, Mar Marcus' marbles will decrease by 69, while Elaine's marbles will increase by 69. But does the total change? No, it doesn't, right? So therefore, this will force under constant total. Alright, since we know the total is unchanged, let's find a total of 5 and 11, right, which is 16. Okay. And give me a guess, what is the after ratio? The answer is 8 is to 8. Okay, why is that so? Alright, because the total is unchanged, which is 16. And since they end up with the same number of marbles, you need to take 16 divided by 2, which is 8. Can you understand? Okay, so give me a guess what's the next step? Right, you can either take 11 minus 8 or 8 minus 5. Right, make sense? Can you see that Marcus or marbles decrease by 3 units while Elaine's marble increase by 3 units? Right, it makes sense, right? Because Marcus is going to give the marbles to Elaine. Alright, so 3 units will be equals to 69. So 1 unit will be 69 divided by 3. Okay, which is uh, 23. Alright, so to find 16 units, right, because they want the marbles all together, you take uh, 23 times 16, and the answer will be 368 marbles. Can you understand? Okay, so when you see questions involving internal transfer, usually the concept tested will be constant total.